What's going on Pixels, Blaze Graphics here and today I've actually got my first ever cutcom on BO3, well I think it's the first, I could be wrong, but yeah I've been playing this game for like 3, 4 weeks, you know since the game actually came out and I ain't even hit one clip, not a quad feed, not a 5 man, and dude if I actually hit a clip right now that would actually be insane, we got to, we got to, any more, any more, any more, double kill, yes! That's sick. And a lot of people say that safeguard is really easy to hit clips. In fact, so easy that clips aren't even that good because they're on safeguard. You know, I don't know if the clip will be usable or not, but either way, to actually have that feeling of hitting a quad feed on BO3 would be absolutely amazing. So I'm going to grind my butt cheek out. I'm going to try and hit some clips for you guys, and that will be awesome. But I don't know if any of you guys could actually tell or not, but I've actually added some kind of like colour filter or video filter, or whatever you guys want to call it, to all of my videos, well not all of my videos, but the videos that I'm making right now, you know, I've added some kind of like video filter to it. And I don't know what any of you guys think, but personally I actually think it makes it look a lot better, you know, really all I've done is just added a bit of contrast, a little bit of colour filter, stuff like that. And I don't know guys, what do you guys think? I think it makes the graphics look a bit better. It almost looks like I'm playing on a PS4, but really I'm just playing on Xbox 360 until you guys actually look up and look at the graphics because they look a lot different on 360. But yeah, I'll add some kind of like before and after on the effect thing whilst I'm like playing this game so you guys could actually tell a difference. But yeah guys, with the PS4 update, my Blu-ray disc and the hard drive has actually came and it still doesn't work but I took the whole thing to parts and it turns out that I don't know if any of you guys actually know what this means but it's basically got no paste where the processor is, it's got like no thermal paste and you basically need that you know like to keep the thing alive so it doesn't overheat or anything and I think that's why it's not working because when I took it to parts it literally had zero paste so I put some new paste on but I had some really cheap thermal paste and still don't work so I'm thinking that's why because you know I put it on and it stays on like I can't explain it like it stays on a little bit longer now than it did last time so all I've done is literally just put paste on it and it stays on a little bit longer so I brought some better thermal paste and hopefully it might actually work but I honestly have no idea guys but the thing is, even if everything does work, I'll have to mess about, you know, buying a PSN that will cost around 40 quid for a year, and a PS4 controller that will cost 30 quid, BO3 that will cost about 30 quid as well, so that's about another 100 quid on top of all the money I've already spent on it, so that's a lot of money. But yeah, it definitely won't be any time soon. Whoa, Jesus Christ, dude, if I had a sniper, triple collat, that could have been my first ever triple collat. And I'm recording, so that would have been amazing for reaction and everything. But yeah, it definitely won't be anytime soon. But yeah, I can't wait. You know, it'll be amazing, you know, playing on next gen and finally moving on from this piece of crap. But yeah, guys, that's pretty much it for the video. Please smash a like on that button. But for now, guys, I'm out. Peace.